Hello and welcome to one in a series of video tutorials filmed by Divine by Design on behalf of Lacente. Today I'm going to show you how to achieve a full neon nail shadow coverage. To start we've applied our CND Shellac Base Coat and Cured and two layers of our CND Shellac Cream Puff and Cured. Now we're going to go in with our top coat and apply thoroughly over the whole nail. Remember nice and thinly. And make sure you've got a really good even coverage. And cap those ends. Once you've applied your top coat, we're ready to pop that in our lamp and cure. Now that our top coat's cured, we're ready to go in and apply our Neon Nail Shadow. I'm going to be using Day Glow Neon, which is a beautiful, bright, zesty orange, perfect for the summer months. And ideally, the best tool to apply this with is a gel brush that you keep just for your Neon Nail Shadows. You can also use it with things like pigments and additives if it's cleaned properly afterwards. But I find that this gets the best application. Lightly pat your brush into your nail shadow. If you get a little bit too much onto the brush, just get your cap and pat it in the cap. You don't need an awful lot on here. When you've just covered your bristles nicely, as we can see here, we can still see the bristles. We haven't got any massive clumping. You're ready to go in straight onto the nail. Now the best way to do this is to gently pat and start closest to the cuticle. and you're going to work your way down. Make sure that you get right down those side walls. If you've seen any areas that you miss, just go back over them. Once you've patted over the whole nail, you're ready to just sweep off the excess. Now you can either use the brush that you've got as long as you're nice and gentle or if you prefer you can go in with a fan brush and just sweep over. Don't worry if you've got any of the nail shadow on the skin that will come off when we cleanse at the end. Once you've got a nice even coverage you're ready to go in with your top coat. Now when we apply our top coat it's important to make sure that you've got enough product on the brush to put a nice little layer between your brush and the Neon Nail Shadow. We're doing this because we don't want to put brush marks into that beautiful even nail shadow coverage. Now the top coat stage is the stage that can make or break an application of nail shadows, pigments, additives, anything like that. If you don't ensure that you have covered all of the areas where you've applied your nail shadow or your pigment, when you come to remove that sticky top film with your alcohol, you'll be left with a white margin anywhere that you haven't covered with top coat. So it is worth spending a little bit more time just making sure you've got right down those side walls. You've capped the free edge of the nail and you've gone right down to the cuticle. And now we're ready to cure. Now we've cured that final layer of top coat, we're ready to go in with a pad soaked with 99% isopropyl alcohol and remove that sticky top film. This is where you will see if there's any bits that you've missed when you've applied your top coat. If you have, then you will end up with little white patches. This is also when you'll be able to remove any excess nail shadow from the skin. And there we go. Beautiful. A perfect neon nail shadow full coverage. Thank you very much for watching. If you want to stay tuned for more videos from Divine by Design and Lacente, if you want to visit Facebook, it's forward slash Lovelacente. Twitter is at Lovelacente. 
and online it's www.lacente.com. Thanks very much for watching.